never knew you in life. Your first life, anyway. You died on a battlefield long before my time. Something special brought us together. They called it the Traveler. And when it arrived, it changed your world forever. It was a golden age. And for centuries, humanity thrived. Until it didn't. An ancient enemy pursued the traveler across the universe. Humanity faced extinction. But the traveler made a choice. Its sacrifice destroyed its ancient enemy and brought life to the ghosts. Travelers chosen. You are a guardian. Yes, yes, I am. This is your destiny. Ah, oh, there it is. Yay. Okay, so hello and welcome to Let's Play Destiny 2. I am the Decepticon Gamer, and here we are looking through our memories of Destiny 1. Not as many, not as many things as uh, probably a lot of other people out there have, considering that uh, you know I haven't, I haven't done any, didn't really any of the raids. So yeah, there there was that. Start a new adventure. Yes, we will. Wait. Why don't I have my... <gasps> Wait a minute. That doesn't make any sense. Where's my Titan? Where's my Titan? Oh, it's because I made it afterwards. Yeah, that's right. Okay. I will have to make a new Titan then. So that'll be an Exo... An Exo Titan. Just like I did for my Road to the 400 Challenge. I was like, why isn't that on there? And like, oh yeah, because I created them after the cutoff date for Transfer into Destiny 2. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and skip this cutscene, though. It's the same one that they showed off at, like, the big reveal at E3, I think it was. Um, so, it's it's the opening cinematic. It, it, it's cool, don't get me wrong, but, you know, I, I'd like to kind of jump into into this and get moving. But yes, a after after some time, I've decided to go ahead and, and do a playthrough of Destiny 2. Since we finished Destiny 1, um, speaking of which, I... When I left off on, or the very last episode of the of the series, um, what was I gonna say? Uh, I was at three ninety nine. I I did go and play a little bit before this and and finish leveling up. So my my hunter on there was four hundred, same as my titan, which is disappointing because it didn't carry over, but whatever. So if when when I go I should make a Titan on here as well, and because uh, I there there is something specific I would like to be able to show off, um, for the unique missions you get for each of the guardians. But I'm not gonna if you haven't if you're not a, familiar with what I'm talking about then you know I'm not gonna spoil anything here. But I do want to I'll probably do an off screen playthrough with my Titan Warlock. Just to get them to those points. Alright, let's do this. The tower is kind of... Uh, kind of messed up right at the moment. Hey, look, it's Cabal. Guardians, run before the plaza. 
Yes, I, I'm aware of how to do a melee attack. Thank you very much. Okay, he's gonna kill him. Bom bom bom. All right. Good luck with that, Cade. Alright, so right off the bat, um, a, a big change from Destiny 1 is the fact that your guns are all totally uh, different in terms of, uh, in the first game you had a primary, a secondary, and a heavy weapon. With this, you, you change that for a kinetic weapon. Uh, which would be in place of your primary, and then and then you also have a, instead of a secondary, you now have an energy weapon. So at any given time, you'll have a primary type weapon, but it will have the attributes of... Uh, it'll have, the, it'll actually have a uh, energy damage on it as well. However, it has it has made it where uh, some weapons are not nearly as I don't want to say useful, but but there's definitely weapons that you don't use as often. Like, I know I, for one, very, very seldomly ever use a sniper rifle anymore. Or or a shotgun, for, for the most part. Just because the since they don't... Since they take up a power, a power weapon slot, I feel like in most cases, having... Having that slot as a rocket launcher... Or a sword is much is uh, much more handy than having than using that slot for a sniper rifle when I could just uh, use say like a scout rifle if I if I need something for long range which I prefer scout rifles so. It's another person. And they just died. That's cool. <laughs> kill you. I'll kill you. And how about one for you? Zavala. What's up, Zavala? Come on, bring it on, Red Legion. Wait, I already repelled an assault? Okay, that's cool. There's some enemies. I was a miss. I'm used to having six shots on my hunter. Oh, well, I guess they were attacking the shield anyway, so it was kind of pointless for me to run back there. Yeah. Let's do it. 
Backflips. Speaker. Got it under control. <gasps> Sweeper bot. You just keep on sweeping, buddy. You just keep on sweeping. I guess I, I could have watched that. Yeah, go at Korra. Oh, there's more. Oh, there's more enemies. Not more enemies. Yeah, why haven't I gotten my extra melee attack yet? There's a new kind of cabal right there. Pretty nice if you can if you can hit them in the uh, in their their tank because then they will explode after right, when you kill them. Do, 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 do. Ow, I'm burning. Oh, when did that guy die? Oh, hello. Hello. Yeah, like if, if you match the damage type on your, on... Someone told me you need a ride. Uh, for an enemy shield, then it'll, it'll cause like an area of effect damage. Pretty nice. You know, the bonus damage is always nice for, especially on the enemies like that, uh, where they have really yellow bars. It's nice, at least in the cutscene, to get to see uh, some of the NPC characters get to do something. Maybe, at some point. Hurrah! There we go. Yeah, I, 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 I see the thing. You know, it's like I can see it on my mini-map. Come on, that should have killed him. It's like, I am sneaking, I am sneaking. I know that doesn't match the damage type, but I figure it all. I'll pump some damage into that guy. There we go. Get him before his shield comes back up. Ha cha cha! Ouch. Uh, 
Oh, you can't kill that one here? Do, 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 do. Yeah, the scions in this one, they're, they're a bit different. Uh, it seems like most of them definitely have a go with the snipers, which a lot of times they do in the first game, but... Um, they also have a void attack, uh, which I find isn't nearly as bad as the... As the one in Destiny 1, where it was the... Like, the wave. It'd be really nice if I had a heavy weapon right about now. But yeah, the the Scion thing will it'll send out a it'll it'll come out in like a straight line, and then if you, if it explodes underneath you, it sends you into the air. But it never seems like it really does a whole lot in the long run. Not any, no shooting fire at me. Oh, come on. He's like one bullet away. One bullet away from death. Ow. Yeah, I know. I can just jump down there, but I want to kill the enemies. Is that so much to ask for? See, I have murdered them all. And now my path is clear. You would think that they would learn. Oh, come on. I don't really have any need to use this otherwise, so... Might as well use it on this guy. do 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 Yeah, I remember when the when the beta came out for this, and apparently people had a lot of difficulty with this this segment. I mean, it's not, and it's not like there was any real um, problem, even if you did die, because you could just re. It wasn't like a respawn restrict zone, so you could just respawn. But uh, there were all there were two of of the big spinning things in the beta, and then they removed one set of them so they didn't cross over each other and make it more difficult. Like eh, whatever. Man, I screwed this ship up. It's Gary. <gasps> no, my light.
No, I'm a ghost. Well, that, that is a hell of an opening as far as I'm concerned. It's kind of a little after the fact, but, you know, I, I had other things to finish up, so, and I had I had plenty of time to spend in this game on my main profile, so. But I think we'll go ahead and leave it there for this episode. Uh, this will continue on into a... Uh, into another mission here, but we're going to go ahead and save that for the next episode. Well, we'll let this play out real quick and... good I just need to get to a point where I can pause okay I'm gonna pause right there and then we're gonna well wait is it actually paused no not really uh, but anyway we're, we're gonna go ahead and leave that for the next time so thank you so much for watching the first episode of let's play destiny 2 I am the Decepticon Gamer, and we'll catch you next time as we find out what's uh, how we're going to come back from, from that. So, see you next time. Bye now.